Minecraft record that sounds impossible. Finding and obtaining an emerald in 0 0.167 milliseconds. That is literally this much time. But I think I've got what it takes to beat it. Attempt number one. Here we go. Come on. You know what? That wasn't terrible. Maybe this record isn't impossible. Yep, I have been humbled. The current record is just such an insane time to try and beat. What was that? Fortune 17 milliseconds. I've just got to stay persistent here. Come on. Ooh, 267. I am slowly starting to see some improvement. Oh my God, did I just do it? Yes, 133 milliseconds. That is a brand new world record. However, this is just the first of the 10 most elusive and difficult speedruns of all time. But seeing as I've already broke one, surely I could break them all, right? Well, next up, I'm attempting one of Minecraft's toughest ever records, the fastest time to fill your inventory. To beat it, you have to fill all 36 slots with completely unique items. And somehow, the current world record did that in 12.96 seconds. So naturally, my aim is to absolutely demolish that time. And 19 seconds. That's not that far away. If I keep this up, I reckon I'll beat this pretty quickly. It has now been three days and I still cannot break this record. In fact, it's so tough, I'm revising my goal to just beat in third place. And I am getting somewhat close. Like my average run is around 14.8 seconds now. But I don't know how I'm meant to do this any faster. You see, the key to these fast records is training your brain to do certain actions automatically as you don't have time to think. Each pixel you aim at and each tiny movement has to be perfectly mastered to stand any chance of getting a decent time. This explains why no one has been able to get a top three run in over six months. But for some reason, I was still confident I could beat it. I will have my name in that top three leaderboard. Mark my words. This feels pretty good. Never mind. 14.5. What was that? Oh, I'm 0.3 milliseconds away. Here we go. Come on. Nice. Good pace so far. Oh, that was really smooth. Please. Please. Yes! Yes! 13.85 by just 0 0.01 milliseconds. I've got third place. What you're currently looking at is one of Minecraft's rarest items, the golden apple. Currently, the fastest time to find this item is 12.63 seconds until today. My plan is to look for worlds that have a ruined portal within a 50 block radius of spawn. And then I'll just hope that I get that 1.5% chance of a golden apple being in the chest. Is that? Yes, that's a ruined portal. Give me what I need. I hate you. Ooh, this one's actually perfect. I could make great time here. Oh my god. I'm seeing one ruined portal with like every 100 worlds here, but none have a golden apple. I am a broken man. Unless... Apple, 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 apple. Yes, finally! All oh, that stress just to find a golden apple, but that is the third of the fastest ever Minecraft world records beaten. Next up, I'm attempting to break fellow YouTuber Cameron's record for the fastest time to find cooked cod for the time of 21 seconds to beat. The key to doing this is to spawn near a shipwreck, dig down at the corners of 9-9, and then hopefully find cooked cod. I will open every buried treasure chest in Minecraft until I break this record. And so I did. How have I not beaten this yet? I'm consistently a few seconds away. It was clear this record was not an easy one to beat. But despite this, I kept looking for hours and hours until finally I dug down and found cooked cod. But in over 20 seconds. I feel like I need a new strategy. The issue is it takes too long to find the right beach and the right place to dig as well. However, I did have a trick up my sleeve. The timer doesn't actually start until you begin moving. Therefore, I could legally cheat. By going into third person, I can work out which way to go to find the buried treasure before I begin moving. Give me cod. Now let's hope this new strategy actually works. Ooh, decent spawn. I think I need to go backwards, right? Come on. Right, 9-9, nine, nine, here we go. <gasps> No way. I have beaten the previous record by over 10 seconds. However, from this point onwards, the time I have to beat each of these records gets less and less. For example, this. The fastest time to get XP level 8 with a time of 12 seconds to beat. Now, normally, I'd attempt the same seed that the current world record used and try and beat their time. However, on this record, I've paid a professional seed finder to hunt down a seed that I might be able to beat the record on. And he's found me this. With a chest full of emeralds buried only a few blocks underneath the trading villager, he theorized I could beat this record in a round... <clears throat> 11 seconds. Come on. I can do this. Here we go. Please, fella, help me out here. 10.71 seconds. Ha! I feel like I could do better than that as well. 10.14 seconds. Get in. I didn't even think that would be possible. Speaking of things I didn't think were possible, I'm about to attempt to perform a survival MLG in less than 10 seconds. The current record did this in one minute, which isn't very fast. However, I recently saw a method that would allow me to make it one of the fastest ever in Minecraft history. By spawning with no items in your inventory, it is possible to do this.
Holy! Yeah, this could be a game changer. See, if you perfectly time pressing W and crouch just before you hit the ground, you will perform a crouch MLG. This record is now possible. I've just got to get consistent. Aha! One. Yes! All right, I think I'm ready to break this record. Why wow, the spawn is good. Ah, that was the one. Ooh, this looks a bit better. This looks good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Oh, it's so slow, though. I feel like I could do better than that. Come on, come on, come on. This is better. Yes! Let's go! Next up, I'm attempting to find and slap one of Minecraft's rarest mobs, the Mooshroom. The time to beat is 12 seconds, which means my only chance of beating it is to spawn on the Mooshroom Island. Now, the chance of that happening is around 1 in 100,000, so surely that would never be beaten, right? Oh my god! I just gotta go for it. Yes, yes! Let's go! I cannot overexpress how lucky I've just gotten. This is record number eight, the fastest ever death. I've actually attempted this record before with a time of 2.84 seconds. And at the time, I thought it was a world record. However, the actual record was 2.53 seconds. Therefore, my one goal here is revenge. Oh yeah, this is a good spawn. Ah, four seconds. Please, just die already. Nope. Nope. This is actually getting ridiculous now. Like, the seed I need to beat this has to be basically built for me to... Please, game, one good seed is all I ask. Oh, okay, this one looks good. Come on, come on, please, please, please. Yes! 1.97! Next up is probably the simplest, but yet the most confusing record because... It seems so easy to break. This is the fastest time to obtain an item. The only rule for this record is that the item cannot come from a chest. And for some reason, the current record broke that by mining a tree and it took them four seconds. Now, I'm not the smartest man in the world, but what I have worked out is an ingenious idea to break this record. That's it. With a time of 0.63 seconds, we have beaten that record. But with one record left to go, it was time to attempt Minecraft's hardest ever record, the fastest time to obtain a diamond. The time to beat is 0.05 seconds. When put into an editing software, that is just three frames. So how am I gonna beat it? To be honest, I have no idea. But I'm gonna try and at minimum get a top three time. Okay, I have to open that chest and right click the diamond into my inventory. Come on. Yeah, this one might be impossible. And... Nope. Ah, we're getting closer. While I'm attempting this record, please check to see if you're subscribed. And if you're not, consider subscribing. Thank you. Come on, this is the one. I'm getting so annoyed here. After four hours of trying this, I was getting nowhere. However, it was at this point that I had quite a good idea. Wait a minute. Because all I'm doing is flicking my mouse, why don't I just massively increase my sensitivity? Oh my lord, where's it going? I cannot control my mouse at all. But this could help me break the record. However, predictably... It didn't. As much as I didn't want to admit it, this record was by far the hardest I'd ever attempted. Nothing I'm trying now seems to be working. I really was just a few runs away from giving up until finally I did the impossible. Come on. Wait a second. 0.067. That's second place. I didn't even realize. Let's go. The person in first can have the crown. Second place with how tough this record is is absolutely insane. Minecraft's fastest world records completed the mate.